Hi everyone, this is Durgesh from Informatica Global Customer Support. Uh, today I'm going to explain you about uh, a DDM Hive connection and how to configure. So, uh, from the latest version onwards, like uh, DDM 981 and 982, uh, we have uh, uh, supported you with the Hive connection, Hive Server 2. So, and also a native Hive connection for uh, Hive CLI. So, uh, for Hive Server 2 connection, we, uh, from DDM, you can achieve this by creating a JDBC connection, which is generic JDBC connection, and uh, which which internally uses uh, a DDM uh, generic JDBC JAR file to redirect all the queries from the uh, any of the client which you are trying to connect to Hive database through DDM. So, uh, in this uh, further in this demo, I'll be showing you the step by step uh, how you can configure the DDM connection in uh, for Hive. Uh, so uh, the second thing would be like uh, the JARs which is required while configuring to Hive Server two using DDM, and the various clients you can use to connect to DDM. Uh, and one of the client uh, SQL developer client configuration I'll be showing you in this demo. So uh, this is my uh, DDM configuration uh, for Hive 2. So like uh, as I mentioned that we will be creating a generic JDBC jar uh, service here for Hive. And uh, so this is a generic JDBC uh, connection service. Like I have created a generic JDBC connection service here. And uh, Similarly, for the Hive 2, I'll be config. I'll be showing you this. So here is the uh, configuration required for Hive 2 generic JDBC. So let me show you this step by step. Like, uh, what are the things which will be required? So, as I mentioned, that the database type will be generic J database, which uses the uh, JDBC URL to uh, connect uh, to the Hive server 2. Uh, so this is as usual DDM database name and uh, this is a driver class name what will be used for uh, Hive drivers to connect to the Hive database. So this driver you can get you, you can um, get it either from the for a, any of the Hive uh, database Hortonworks or Cloudera and just provide the driver name here. <coughs> And uh, this, this is the uh, connection string URL. So uh, this also you can get it uh, from online or the URL is JDBC Hive 2 and the uh, Hive server host name and the port and the database name slash database name. So and this is the username and password. So majorly this is the things which we require. Uh, also, uh, I will show you uh, since uh, this is a driver class name which we provide. Uh, so, while doing a test connection or connecting from the DDM, it requires specify some specific draw files in in the DDM DDM installation directory. So, let me show you the list of draw files which it requires. So, this is my DDM installation directory, and this is a library folder. So once you go into this library, there is an ext folder which is called external jar files to be placed here for any of the uh, database where you use a generic JDBC uh, service or generic database connection type. So in the external uh, directory, we have few jar files. Uh, out of these jar files, uh, these jar files you can get uh, you can get it from the uh, Hive server to uh, directory. Uh, it, it, with respect to the Cloudera or Hortonworks, any any of the distribution uh, should be fine. So major uh, JAR files to be uh, placed here is Hadoop Core, and uh, uh, this is a 1.2.1 uh, version. Uh, this is respect to the Hive Server 2 version. So uh, currently, I am showing a demo which uh, used to connect to Hive Server 2 1.2.1, and uh, the other version would be a standalone jar file, Hive JDBC 1.1 standalone jar file. And the other one 
which is required for connecting this is hive meta store on the point of jar file so these are the three major jar files which has to be present in this h directory while uh, trying to test the connection from ddm so uh, by default we have not provided any jar file uh, location in this connection details in ddm so by default it picks from the jar files from the ex directory and finds the uh, class name in in the jar files present in the ex directory so let's do the test connection for this uh, so as you can see it's it's going fine here test connection validated so this is how the hive server 2 connection uh, should be uh, configured from ddm yeah so uh, we have seen the required jars to connect to hive 2 from ddm and uh, various clients uh, to connect to uh, uh, hive server or um, through ddm can be uh, sql developer and aqua data studio and squirrel so please follow us for further uh, kb videos uh, which explains about uh, ddm connectivity through any of these clients through uh, to hive server too so you can refer uh, ddm administration guide for uh, more details and for uh, detailed steps uh, so uh, thank you for watching this video uh, i would love to hear uh, feedback on this video so you can uh, share your feedback uh, through support uh, videos at informatica.com or you can tweet to our twitter account info support thank you